All right. Uh, what do you what do you have to say about Eric Swalwell? Is he amazing? I have the great pleasure of serving on the Judiciary Committee with Eric and having served on the Intelligence Committee, and he is such a great champion for California, for our democracy, uh, and he is such a great friend. Uh, Eric, I can't thank you enough for your leadership. Let's hear it for Eric Swalwell. And... Maria Elena Durazo, is she not the most incredible powerhouse senator in the state of California? What a great champion she has been for working families. What a great champion she has been for a comprehensive immigration reform. And what a great friend she has been. Uh, Maria Elena, I can't thank you enough uh, for all of your support. And Lindsay Horvath, our incredible county supervisor. What a great champion you are of housing and the LGBT community, and I am so thrilled uh, and grateful to you for your words this evening. But uh, it looks like we're going to the general, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> so a little over a year ago, we kicked off this campaign, uh, and I won't say it was without its bumps along the way, I seem to recall, although it's a little hazy, that within hours of our announcement, a certain Kevin McCarthy kicked me off the Intelligence Committee. Yeah, that was my reaction, too. Uh, and then, at the urging and badgering of Donald Trump, Republicans censured me for holding him accountable. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, you know, I viewed it that way. And then uh, Trump would attack me after rally after rally. And I think all those things were basically what we would call Wednesday. Uh, but you had my back every step of the way. Every step of the way. You helped us build the biggest grassroots campaign for Senate in California history. And I cannot thank you enough. Uh, I want to... <clears throat> I want to thank, uh, in particular, I want to thank my family. My wife, Eve, is here tonight. Um, this is my wife, Eve. I want to thank... I... I want to thank you all. Thank you all so much. We, uh, we are so lucky, so lucky to live in a democracy where we all have the right to protest. We are so lucky to live in that kind of democracy. And we want to make sure that we keep this kind of democracy. So you had a chance. You had a chance to meet my wonderful wife, Eve. Thank you. Thank you. So I want to... I want to thank you all. I want to thank you all so much. Uh, and in particular, in, in addition to my wonderful wife, Eve, I also want to thank my daughter, Alexa, and my son, Eli. It would not be possible to get through all the travails of these challenging times without my incredible family. I also want to thank my brother, Dan, uh, and my brother David, who is also here this evening. 
And I want to thank... And I want to thank uh, all of my constituents as well. So I want to uh, I want to thank you again, all of your support. We built an amazing grassroots team, and I want to thank my extraordinary campaign staff. I want to thank all of my wonderful supporters. I want to thank my incredible constituents. It has been such an honor of a lifetime to serve the wonderful, incredible people of California's 30th District. And I want to give a special shout out tonight uh, to Speaker Pelosi, the greatest speaker of all time, who gave me such an incredible opportunity to serve in the U.S. Congress and to take on some of the most important leadership roles in our democracy. I also want to thank Barbara Boxer, uh, who encouraged me to run for the Congress and has been with me every step of the way. And I want to also thank our incredible speaker, Robert Rivas, who I think will go down in history as one of the greatest speakers in the California legislative history. But tonight, I also find myself thinking a great deal of Senator Feinstein. Senator Feinstein, who was an incredible giant in the U.S. Senate, somebody who was not afraid to take on the biggest fights, but somebody who also knew how to get things done. And it's been my privilege to work with her when she was the head of the Intelligence Committee. Um, um, and when I was working on the Senate side, when she was on the Senate side, I was working on the House side. But I also want to acknowledge again my great gratitude to all of my wonderful supporters. I want to acknowledge the right of our protesters, and I look forward to working with you all and onward to victory in November. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you. And let's go on and win this thing. On to November, everybody, and thank you for all your support. Thanks, everyone. Thank you.